The Burlington Fine Arts Association recognized outstanding local artists this past weekend at the Hub in the Burlington Center. Nikki Wesley explains. The Burlington Fine Arts Association juried show, The Artist's Mark, has been showcasing local artistic talent since 2019. You know, if we think about why art is important, it's important because it helps us appreciate the beauty that is around us, but it's important because it also helps us expand our imagination and how we see the world. And one of the things that I love when I look at fine arts is how an artist is interpreting the world around them and the feelings and the emotions and the thoughts that are evoked when you look at a piece of art that allow you to expand your mind and expand how you see the world around you as well and to see it through somebody else's eyes. On Sunday, jurors announced the winners of this year's show. Honorable mentions went to Magali Vrio for Determination, Kathy Loraway for Fishing by Moonlight, and Vanessa Cress Locos for her piece, Yellow Dress. Tim Laspa took third place with Edifice, his portrayal of Hamilton City Hall. The time that it was actually created, the design and the energy and the enthusiasm, I wanted to bring that back in some way and sort of show that image in a way that, that was a bit playful at times in terms of the color selections and also a bit, um, it made, you know, setting it in a time of day that might uh, cause people to give it a second thought in terms of how they look at the building. In her second Artist's Mark show, Tina Baker took second place with Ohm. I can't believe it. I actually, because there's amazing art here, and just to be juried into this show is quite a feather in your cap. Ohm depicts a Tibetan singing bowl from her yoga practice. I tell you, so many times I was dying to put some high gloss on it, like make it look shiny, and I resisted. And we are okay the way we show up. It's all perfect. And that's the message I was hoping, here I am, I'm just here. I don't have to impress anyone, you know? And that in itself is very powerful when, when you feel that way. Victoria Pierce was inspired by the forest fires and heavy smoke last summer. She took first place with her unique labyrinth landscape style. So this piece was from an image from my cottage and then it introduced the fire because that's how I felt like it could be could be my space, could be any of our space, because we were all affected. And the title, Fire is Burning, Fire is Burning, Draw Near, Draw Near, is from a children's um, song that I used to sing with my brownies when I was a brownie leader and at the camp I go to. And it's reminiscent of that idea of having, you know, s'mores and marshmallows and singing them at a campfire, very innocent. But here, the tables are turned and it, it's it's threatening instead of endearing and it's a reminder that this is not something that's just a fun thing it's a it's a very scary thing and important that people pay attention to it the artist's mark is on at the hub in the burlington center until october 27th for halton news i'm nikki wesley